Hi there, happy Friday. Thank you for joining me for the MLS Compliance video. I am Eric, your MLS partner here at the South Bay Association of Realtors. And I'm going to talk about uh, this topic that had done a video previously. And this is for CR MLS Rule 11.5, subsection D, subsequent use of media. Now I'm gonna talk about this again because in the last quarter, there were two violations of this. And this did cost each of the members uh, for this offense, uh, $1,500, so $1,500 that for a violation that is actually very simple to avoid. So what, in essence, there's twofold to this um, rule. I mean, in essence, one is uh, if you're going to use photos for your listing that was previously listed prior, and you want to use those photos because they're great, that's, that's awesome, just be sure to get written consent from the previous listing agent or broker to use those photos. Once you do obtain the permission, be sure that they send you the original file. Do not copy it from the MLS from the previous listing and upload it as your own. That will be a violation because those photos have already been copywritten. So be sure to upload the original files from the previous listing agent or broker. And also, this, by, this is a violation if you use photos from the MLS to upload onto your social media pages without prior written consent or approval from the listing agent or broker. And if you upload it into your social media accounts, it will be reported because it is copyrighted as well, and you will get hit with a $1,500 fine. There is no warning, it is immediate. So if you would like more um, information about rule 11.5, subsection D and how to avoid it, feel free to reach out to us. Uh, my email is mls at southbayaor.com. And thank you, have a great weekend. See you next time, bye-bye.